Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. If your dream is to become a data analyst or a data scientist, then cracking the SQL interview is a very important stage for attaining your dream. Myself, MLU Prasad, I am a mentor for data science and analytics. If your dream is to become a data scientist or a data analyst, then I can help your goal by explaining various questions asked in the top interviews, which are already available in the LeetCode platform. All the code solutions for the questions are can ask in the LeetCode platform are there in my GitHub repository. The link for that is available in the chart description below. In addition to that, I have segregated the channel into five playlists, namely easy, medium and hard depending upon the sorry, easy, medium and hard depending upon the difficulty of the question, the premium level subscription question as premium playlist and also all the questions which are there in uh, Lead code as one single playlist ordered by their sequence number. Let's see the question which we are trying to solve it today. It is question number 1783 type medium and it's called grand sum titles. Let's see the question. Okay, it is already asked in Amazon. Table A consists of players, player numbers and player names and player 2, okay, table 2 consists of championships where in each year and in each competition, how many the champions has won? Let's see the table. Okay. If you see here, one another, how many won? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 7 he won 2 Federer 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 yeah 5 he won Novak is there Novak 0 so what we need to do we want this uh, count of 1's count of 2's and count of 3's but they are horizontally so there is a trick what we will do we will select Wimbledon from this table 1 1 2 and we will join using union all this French Open Union all 111 again 122 two. this US Open Union all again same 122 two. this then we will get all these four rows vertically right after vertically we can just group by that and count it and we can join this table and we get the answer let's see the thing select Wimbledon as some ID from championship union all select all F4 open as ID from championship Union all select open IZ from championship union all select AU open ISID from championship let's run this and see the table this should be id okay let's keep this in brackets
okay it should be championships okay we have joined all these rows horizontally let's call it some CTE now from CTE let's group by ID select the ID comma count of rows it's called titles okay here you can see one one seven times two one five times let's call it CT2 and let's do player ID first do the join things from players A inner join sorry inner join CT to B on A dot player ID equal to B dot ID yes let's run it okay we've got only the player number we need player name also comma player name comma we want titles I think it's title or title yeah titles as grand slam count Okay. They didn't told it to order anything, but let's try to order by player ID. Still, it's getting wrong. player ID SND okay it wants descending sorry got the same output what is the issue player ID player name grand slam total 2121 Federer Federer 5757 let's try to keep it here then once Nadal has won seven times, Federer has won five times. Okay, it should have S. Our solution has been accepted by the platform. Thanks for watching my video. If you want more detailed explanations like this, please subscribe to my channel and share it with your friends who are preparing for data analyst or a data scientist interview. 
Thanks for watching. Keep practicing.